Okay, so we just gotta. I was just gonna let it come in, the, you know, all the way in, but let me let me just let everybody come on in. Okay, so happy International Friends Day. All right, so let's let's just let's just cut to the chase. Let's just be done with it. Let's just like let's just be done done. Okay, we're just gonna be done done. Um, with your, some of you are not gonna like it. I don't really care, um, but I'm fully, I'm fully at the okay. We we're we're done. I'm done with the, the kick gloves. I'm done with the nonsense. I'm done with that. Okay, we're gonna be done with that. So we're gonna be we're gonna be done. We're gonna be done done. Okay. So I know a lot of you. I sometimes see that he does a lot of talking and he doesn't say what he wants to say and all this other stuff. So we're just gonna be done. We're gonna talk about it all because I'm, I'm just done. Okay, so we we I first I first want to I, I first want to address the the I guess you would say the elephant in the room. I don't fuck with T. S. Madison at all. Okay, let me let me address that. And put that out. Fuck T. S. Madison. Okay, fuck her. Fuck the bullshit. Fuck the lies. Fuck the nonsense. Fuck all of it. Okay, fuck the nonsense. I'm done with it. Okay, fuck T. S. Madison and her lying phony bullshit ass. Okay, it's full of shit. Full of her own shit, full of her own drama, full of her own shit, and I'm sick of it. Okay, so I told you guys when I the other day that she does a lot of subliminals up under the video. It was a lot of I ain't seen her say nothing. I ain't seen her do this. I ain't seen her. you know where she does it. She does it on her Patreon. So let me give her what she wants to use you guys for more money. So let me help you guys give her more money because this is what she needs. Okay, this is what she needs. So let me let me give you this so you can go with so you can know where to go. Okay, so this this would be hold on. This would be the Patreon. You need to go to that Patreon and 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 put give her five dollars so you go, you guys can watch her so you can watch her bash me over there because she won't address me. She won't get on the phone. She won't answer a text message. She won't answer a phone call. She won't do nothing. So this is what she's got to do. She's got to go on her Patreon, right? Where you guys have to pay to see it. Where you, you have to pay to see it. So when you pay to see her page on her Patreon, when you pay to see her page on her Patreon, she could sit on her Patreon with the people that she, she that pay her to talk about me. Because this is what she chooses to do instead of being a, a real adult and having a real face-to-face -face conversation, or a phone call, or, or or a FaceTime conversation, or any of this. So she decides to go on here, she decides to go on here, and talk about me, okay? So, let me give you, because you got, because there's, there's people, there's people, there's people on here like Kayla Patrice Davis, that thinks that I didn't know, that I didn't know. I, I didn't, you, Kayla Patrice Davis, let me call you out by your name because that's how much I'm not playing with any of y'all. Kayla Patrice Davis, you didn't know that I knew that you were over here trying to bring information over to her like I cared, as if I wouldn't say what I wanted to say to her face. I would say what I wanted to say to her face if she was woman enough, adult enough to have a real conversation. But because... We don't know how to have a real conversation because we don't know how to be an adult because we live our life in front of a camera and we're a complete farce. We pretend to people that we're one thing, but we do absolutely nothing. So, again, like I said, I want to help you guys support her in her endeavors of bullshit. OK, I want you I want to help you guys. I, I want I want to help you guys support her bashing me. So I want to send you guys to her Patreon. Again, let me show you so you know, so you don't get any misinformation. I want you to go to her Patreon, and then you can get in the comments and you can see. Let me give you one. Let me let me give you one of it. Uh, and whoever doesn't like that I'm talking about this still, that's your that's your business. But I, I'm I'm at the I'm at the I'm at the throat level of I'm out. Okay, I'm tired of the the backstabbing. And the reason you guys don't all see it is. No, Derek, Derek, not for the last few days. It's only been the other day. I addressed it last, actually, when I left in February. But the person keeps talking about me on doing subliminal posts. And she does all these things. And she just did it again. 
on her. And the reason the reason you can't see it is because it's on her Patreon where you have to pay to see what she says. So it's another scam and another scheme for her to get you guys to pay her to talk about me instead of saying what you want to say to me, which I'm saying to you, talk to me. But you won't talk to me. But instead, you want to get on this Patreon and talk about me. So let me explain to you. Because, you know, Kayla Patrice Davis is over here, it, it, over here on my page. Follows me on my Instagram, follows me on my Facebook. I knew you, I knew you, I knew you liked her. I mean, girl, you should have just said what you wanted to say. If that's what you wanted to do to be a reporter, girl, feel free to be a reporter. I don't care. There's no fear over here with saying what I want to say. So, Kayla Patrice, let me help you out. Mother, put the Patreon people you trust in a group call on Facebook Messenger. We got to talk, LOL. That's you, Kayla Patrice Davis. And this was said, child, you seen the, this is Madison now. Child, you seen the foolishness of attention-seeking behavior. Clearly, they not ever getting in. Excuse me. Clearly, they're not ever getting it, ever. I got too much real shit going on. Madison has so much real shit going on. Oh, no, I never said it was free, Brian. You got to pay her. You got to pay her to listen to her talk about me instead of just address me off the camera like a real individual does. She's got to go over there on her Patreon and talk about me. But you have to pay her five dollars because that she needs the five dollars. OK, so we're going to. So you have your people because Kayla Patrice Davis to whoever's on this live or whoever sees it after this video is done when I am done. She feels that some of you guys are on my page to report back to Madison. Hmm. I wonder who's reporting back to Madison. I, again, I make, I, I make the video and I don't mind saying what I need to say to the person, but the person won't get on the phone or anything. She won't talk to me in person because she's because she's too much of a coward to address a real individual to their face on a phone call, anything. So that's it. I don't give a fuck about her wanting to reunite Cia Dixon. I don't get it's a wrap. She can't be an adult. I'm done. So she needs the $5 again from you guys on Patreon. So you guys can go on her Patreon and see her talk about me all day long. Because I just, I gave her $5. I want you guys to know, I'm not telling you to go over there and not give her your money. I want you to give her your money because I just gave her my $5. Because she needs it. Madison needs it for the busy life she's got. In the 10-year-old house she's got. That she ain't did a motherfucking thing for. That a bitch is so rich, but they still ain't done their basement. Now, 10 years later, we're talking about up in our property value. OK, but you're so rich. You're so rich. You got to every day tell everybody you're so rich. You're so rich. You're so rich. You're so rich. You got to You got to let everybody know every day that you are so rich. I don't know who in life has to let individuals know that they are so rich. You just fix your floor. You, do you want to do you really do you really want to talk about what your carpet looks like in your house before you did the floor? Do you want to talk about the carpeting carpeting throughout your home? Do you want to talk about the, all the beds except for the bed that you the bed that you bought last year is from 10 years old and disgusting? Do you want to talk about how your your plumbing doesn't work in your house? Do you want to talk about how you don't let nobody be in, her, in your bedrooms? Do you want to talk about that? Do you want to talk about how disgusting your room is? Do you want to talk about how disgust you ever you guys ever notice? You, you guys ever notice that when she does anything in her bathroom, she always shoots it up here? Yeah, because the rest of that shit is a monstrosity. It's filth. Filth. It's trash. She lives in trash. She is a messy, disgusting, unorganized individual. Okay? You guys have no idea. That lady hasn't done shit since she bought that house. Oh, that's right. She got that money that she got the house from. She got that money that she got the house from for ratting on the man she was with. And she put him in jail. But this is your this is your savior. This is your person. Spiderwebs all in the house. The house is a joke. That lady is a joke. OK, you want to talk about the lady want to talk about. No, I'm not, Diana, because I'm done. Because she's over there on her Patreon, Diana, talking about me every day. And because you guys can't see it if you don't pay for it, she don't 
she 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 she'll she'll tell you guys on her other videos. She'll tell you guys on her other videos. Oh no, I don't do nothing. That man is just attacking me. See, guys, I don't do nothing. See, he's over there trying to get attention. No, I'm not trying to get attention. No, I'm not trying to get attention. I'm sick of you talking about me behind a, a camera that you behind a guise of you trying to charge people five dollars to have you watch them talk about me instead of being a real one and say what you want to say to my face or on the phone. But I'm tired of you because you keep going. I keep telling you, stop carrying on the subliminal shit. Stop carrying on. I just read the message earlier of what she said. That she carries on in the comments. The lady is talking too much. She should have she should have chose to talk about other people. Not me. Not me. I tried several times. I tried through the years to talk to her. I tried phone calls. Let me tell you the phone because I know that supposedly it was I needed to call her. Okay? All right. Well, on... Tuesday, May 19th at 6.30, 6 .30 p.m., my text was, so you want to have a re have this real conversation or not? This was in May because I hadn't heard anything since February when I left. Okay? Okay, well, I don't give a... F well, no, I don't have to be... I'm, you know what, Tyrone? Fine. Don't listen to it then. But I'm done. And I'm tired of her acting like she not doing nothing when she really is the one over there doing it. And because you guys can't see it, because if you don't carry, because if you don't stay on her Patreon, you don't see it. She does this thing. This is what she does. I, excuse me. Excuse me. I, Michelle Antoinette Hudson Brunson, when did I live there? When did I live there? Don't, don't talk about what you don't know, ma'am. Don't, don't talk about what you don't know. I didn't live there. I stayed there here and there when we had work to do the first two years, and we were on the road a lot of that. Meaning that I gave her the first few years of my life where we had to do what we had to do. So stop this. Don't, t don't talk about what you don't know. I didn't live there. I don't need to live a single person because no, we'll get there. Oh, but I don't, but Marilyn Latrice, I don't get paid. That's the point. I'm not charging anybody. I'm not making a business about talking about her. I'm not making it a business to talk about her. I'm not making, I don't make money off of talking about her. That's the thing. The lady makes money off of talking about me. The lady uses you guys and you guys just sit there unapologetically like, yeah, everything she says is right. No, that lady is a liar. That lady has issues, mental capacity issues. Mental capacity issues. Janice passed being hurt for me, honestly. I'm not, now I'm angry. I'm not hurt. I'm not hurt anymore. It's like this lady is over there. Well, I'm fine if you don't think I should give her energy. That's fine. But that lady is over there in her comments talking and bashing. She's been doing it for months. She's been doing it for months, and I'm done with the with the continual, continual subliminal or which well, it's subliminal on the other pages where it's free. But on the paid stuff, it's not subliminal. You will join that Patreon for five dollars. Remember, five dollars. Because she needs your $5 to hear her talk about me. So make sure you give her that. Make sure you give her that $5. Okay? I have reached out to the lady. I have done all the things. Nobody, there's no responses, no nothing. So anyway, so we're going to talk about how she's such a... So this lady is such a business, right? She's such a business. The lady is such a business. Okay? Because she want to talk all her stuff. That she got this, she got that. I got money. I do this. All my businesses. I don't know where these... Phantasmal extra businesses came from because I've never seen them. But okay, we'll let you have your story because that's all you do is tell stories. So let's talk about, let me tell you the name of the book. Let me not misquote the name of the book because I don't forgot because I, it's not something that I, 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 I do anything with. So let me see. Let me see the book that's on Amazon. The book that's on Amazon. Okay? Shade. I like through the shade. You know the book that Madison did? You remember the book? You remember this book? You guys ever realize that Madison doesn't promote the book? You, ever, you guys ever wonder why Madison, the, the, the great the great TS, the great business person? You ever wonder why she hasn't promoted the book? Because the reason she hasn't promoted the book is because the bitch doesn't own the book. And every time you guys bought the book, she never got paid for it. Because Jasmine P. Rain, also Nina Cole, stole the rights to the book. On her ass. That they started that they started working on that book before I came around, and then I came in there and tried to finally get them to finally finish it. Oh, but Madison had already agreed to stuff with Jasmine Pre Rain, so all I could do was sit by and watch. Well, yeah, 
See how it says the author? You see how Madison's not even listed as the author? See how it says Jasmine P. P. Rain? She don't get no money from Jack. She don't get no money from that book. This book, Madison gets no money from this book because she let the lady, she let the lady take her to the, she let the lady dupe her. She let the lady, she let Jasmine P. Rain, Nina, AKA Nina Cole, dupe her. She gets no money. She gets no money from that book. Not a single dollar from the book. So all the time that you guys buy the book, all the times that you, all the times that you guys bring the stuff over there and you bring it for the sign, she wasn't getting nothing. She didn't get no, she gets no money for her book. That businesswoman, that businesswoman, that businesswoman that's always like, bitch, I got money. I do this. I got this. Yeah, she's a liar. She's a fraud. Like I said originally, she's a fraud. She's a phony. Okay, in February, when I made my video in February, that lady could have could have took it out her way and talked to me and handled it and off the screen and we could have been done because the first video was not nasty. Okay, then she went to try to talk about me on a video in her innuendo way and go talk about me. Now I got depression. I was this. I was that. She put up a video clip from the party of the day I left and she was in the comments agitating the, the things, saying all kind of nasty shit about me. I was this. I was that. Okay, I let that go. I addressed it in a video. The second video. I ain't said nothing since then. Every day, and maybe not every day, but every other day, just she's on somebody's whatever. When, then she was on Chi Chi's Live one day. And she said on Chi Chi's Live one day. Well, me and Gio not, me and Gio just mad at each other. We, we just not talking to each other right now. We just not talking about, we're not just, we just not talking to each other right now. Really? Because I didn't know. Because I haven't talked to you, so I don't know what lie you're trying to tell them people. Bitch, we haven't spoken since February 6th, let's be clear. I hit it. I quit. And I left your fucking broke ass. I left your disgrunt, your fucking miserable ass. I am, it's, it's the best day of my life to have left you where you were in the past. Okay? I left. You didn't let me go. Okay? So again, remember, you want to get her talking about me. You want to get her talking about me. You got to go to her Patreon and subscribe. You got to go to T.S. Madison Hinton or I think it's T.S. Madison Hinton or Patreon and subscribe and pay five dollars to let her talk about me. OK, so 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 ma'am, again, the Shade Queen, if you guys want to buy her book, she's not going to get any money from it. She's not going to get it because she doesn't own it. She's never received any money from it. OK, she's never received any money from it. She's a liar. Just so you guys know. That's why she doesn't promote it because she doesn't receive any money from it. Just so, just so we're aware. Just so we, we, just so we're aware. Okay. All right. So I just want to make sure you know. All right. So let's go to let's go on to another topic. Hmm. What else should we talk about? So you guys remember this album? Do you guys remember that album she put out? You remember that album that T.S. Madison put out? Do you remember that? Do you remember that album? Let me let me let me see what album that was. Hmm. Let me look that up. Oh, yeah. Remember this album? You remember that? In 2014? You remember that? The New Supreme, the EP? Oh, okay. Well, she didn't get any money for that. She still doesn't get any money for that. She never received a dollar because against my better advisement, she went and thought because she has to be the boss and she has to do it all. She don't let nobody do what they got to do. OK, she don't let nobody do what they got to do. Oh, uh, ZZ, I did. Oh, yeah, I, I did subscribe to the Patreon. And ZZ, you know why it matters? Why it, what she puts up there? Because she's the same person that gets on her camera or where you guys see every general public can see it. Everybody can see it and say, I don't say nothing when she's actually a liar. She says constantly all the time, I don't say nothing about him. I don't do nothing. I don't do nothing. Well, her Patreon that you have to pay the five dollars to see, you will see clearly. I just read a comment earlier. Well, she's in there talking about me. So, I, I, yeah, it does matter because the lady's a phony. That's why it's easy to answer your question. So going on, going on back to the new Supreme, because we I could go back to 2013, 2014, because you know why? I was here. I was there. See, you guys just think you know, but I was there. So 2014, this album, this album right here, she doesn't own that album. She gets no money from that. She gets no money from that. You don't get any money from that. 
All of that stuff. When we toured the country with that, you get, no, Star Versace, this is not part two. This is done, too. This is done. This is done. So I'm done. Okay? So, okay, well, then let it be messy. Misha Gillum, you must have missed the point that she won't speak to me because she's not adult to have a real, a real live conversation with a person. So let it be messy because I've been done since February. The lady over there with the subliminals are talking shit and then on her Patreon talking about me freely. So let's not go there. Know what you know. Don't question what you don't know. And don't think you know what you know because I know because I was there. Thanks. Anyway. So. No, it's not draining anything, Michael. I'm good. I'm because this is gonna this is gonna be the finale for me. Cause she can't come back from this one. Cause this one, this one I could prove. Okay. So let's just go to so the new Supreme, the new Supreme, she don't get no money from that. So this big boss lady, this big boss, she the boss. I'm sorry, she Bessie, this is what you got when you stop running your mouth. What? She's messy. This is what you get when you stop. I don't know what that means. So, so the boss, the boss, you know, the boss, how she runs her business. She said she, she's by her business. She the one. Yeah, the new Supreme. She don't get no money from the new Supreme. So whenever y'all buy that album, make sure you buy that album where it's got that girl, that, 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 that girl. Remember, she's that girl. Remember, she's that girl. Yeah, she was touring the world doing that girl for free because she was, except if it was at a gig that I got her. Yeah, from the same person that never mattered and I was nobody, right? Yeah, yeah, the same person that was never there. Oh, okay, yeah, so she don't get no money from, from the new Supreme. That, 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 that girl. So all of that, when you guys buy that, make sure you guys go out and buy that and help American Commission get their coin up. <laughs> get American Commission, help American Commission succeed. Okay, well, ZZ, then you don't, have to, you don't have to be here for it. I'm sorry it's too much for you. I'm sorry. There you go. Just, just go away. It's okay. So, the new Supreme, that's done. Okay, what do you mean what really happened with Kaya? I told you exactly what happened with Kaya. I told you exactly what happened. I don't retract any statement I made. I think that if Kaya was more well-spoken, she would have gotten her point across better. But because she's not more well-spoken... Because she's not well spoken, it did their point got lost in the sauce because she's not very well spoken. That's why. And two, there was never Madison didn't let me do my job. I was not able to make I didn't handle any money. I didn't handle any money. This is all this money. This is this this was none of this. None of this. Okay? It was not how it was not what you don't understand is it was not this management thing that you that everybody thought it was supposed to be. It was not as easy as everybody. I was not able to do my full job. Okay? So let's say so the new Supreme, like I said, is not hers. Okay, let me give you another one. Because I do remember that people were also saying, excuse me. People were also saying that, you know, because I know I know a lot of y'all felt that I was living the life. I was getting the coin. I was, oh, baby, he doing what he got to do. But he doing what he got to do. He, huh, him and the TS is making that money. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're going to address, we're going to address the money. Let's address the money. You know how the ladies always like, bitch, I pay mine. I pay invoices. I pay invoices. You remember that? I pay invoices. I do this. Ain't nobody got, that ain't nobody got no, ain't nobody got no money problems. Yeah. Ain't nobody got no money problems? All right. All right. So I want you to see. I want you to see. Here you go. Here you go. You see what that says? You see what that says? I have received 143 payments. I have sent her 347. And I have received, what does that number say? 27,900. Oh, it's not going to hurt me to buy this at all. I'm good. Thanks. 27,000. You see that? 27,900. You see that? Did you see that? So I want to let me read that to you again. The, the payments were 100. I, she's paid me 143 times. I paid her 347 times. And the received amount was 27,900. This is cash app. This is all the money I've ever received from her on cash app in seven years. Do you want, do you want to, I let that sink in. Let me get back to that. 
That's 143 payments. It's 143 payments. I've sent her 347. And I've received 27,900 in seven years. Anybody want to figure that? Anybody, any, any, anybody want to tell me? Anybody want to tell me how I wasn't here for the lady? How I wasn't really here to really see her grow to a better person? Anybody want to explain that to me? I'm, I'm waiting because I, I this Megan, correct. That's oh, OK. Show me Washington. All right. Well, I got more. Show me Washington. Don't worry. So that's just the cap. That's just cash app. So in seven years, in seven years, the cash app is twenty seven thousand nine hundred. OK, you see it right there. See, that's cash app. You see that? You see that? So I, I'm not I, I, I'm not there yet. I just want you to see the cash app amount. So that's seven years. Seven years of twenty seven thousand nine hundred. Right. Okay, just want you to, do, somebody in here doing math. I see you, Benita. So somebody in here doing math. Okay, all right. So that's 27,900 on Cash App in seven years. Okay, let's go back to, all right. So in 2020, oh no, James, there's nothing to sue her for. I don't want nothing. She tried me, I'm done. I'm just, I'm just done. Okay, so 2020, this is PayPal. I want you to see this is PayPal. Let me see. Can I see? Can I show you that? You see that's PayPal. You see that this is 2020, and you see that that is from. Oh, does it say it under there? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. You see it right there. You see where it's from, right? You see where it's from. You see the. So you see. So you see the person. Okay. In 2020. In 2020. This is what I made. Now, granted, I was only there till February, but this is what I made in 2020. This is what I made for 2020. Okay, that's 2020. Let me, let me, let me. Oh, okay. Let me go backwards. 2017. This is PayPal. It's PayPal now. Okay. So remember, it's 27,000. It's 27,907 years on Cash App. Right? Okay. So we're going to go back to, you see the dates? Let me make sure you, can, you guys can see the dates. You see what's circled in there? Okay. And you see the name. And you see the name, right? Okay. That's what I made in 2019 from PayPal, from her. Okay. 154027. Okay, since I was doing it right, since I was since, since 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 I was since I was taking something from her, since I was taking something from her, right? So I so I was taking something from her, right? Okay, so this is 2017, 2017 to 2018, RDE Multimedia Group. Okay. Okay, you see? Okay, you see that. That's what I made in 2017 to 18. Okay. Oh, Adrian. Well, what? What? Okay, well, let me, Gio. Uh, Adrian, let me answer you, Adrian Lancaster. What, at, what, may I ask what started this? I don't know what started it. The lady, I don't, I, I'm, I'm really trying to understand why, Adrian, I have never even mentioned you and you keep getting into this. This situation. What started it is that your 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 who you work for, who you work for won't be honest. Who you work for is disgusting. Who you work for is rude. Who you work for is a liar. Who you work for is a phony. She has mental issues. She is a nasty, disgusting, miserable human being. She will not. She blames me for something that I had nothing to do with. That someone in someone that she's still around, someone that she's still around, is the cause of the problem she had. Why her friend of 17 years moved out the house. And so it had been seven years coming of dealing with her nonsense. I was no longer going to take the last, that was the last straw that was going to break me. Because that was it. 
What are you talking about? Why am I not talking to her? She doesn't talk to... Ne ever, never mind. Anyway. So, I'm trying to... Uh, Adrian, I don't know what you... Uh, Adrian, I don't know what your conversations with her are. So, I don't really know what this is about. And why we're just... Why you keep asking me what started it or what the problem is. You haven't been around the whole time. I don't know. I know that that lady has told you whatever she has told you. But I just proved to you what I wasn't doing. So if I was nobody and I didn't care, I just wrote that down in paper form with printouts. So I'm just, I mean, I could go, I could go to my, let me go to my cash app so you can see it. So you can know that I'm not lying. Okay, because there's zero dollars in there. Hold on. Let me go into it. All right. Since we're, since we're, again, I'm being questioned about all things that I say and do. When I don't understand, let me see. Okay, so, hold on, that's the wrong one. Hold on, let me put it in here. Oh, oh I think she's blocked on here, so I can't print it back up. But I printed it. So it is what it is, I'm not going through unblocking her at the current moment. So, oh, Dwayne Rogers, I'm, def oh, I'm sorry, you're defending, I'm defending Mac management. I understand. I appreciate it. Thank you. So, Adrian, I don't really know why you're asking me what brought it on. The lady is constantly over in her Patreon in the comments talking, and I read that earlier. So, I don't, my conscience has been clear the whole time, but she's, con she's constantly talking about me. If I don't matter, just don't talk about me. Okay, so again, let me go back to what I was talking about. 27, so in seven years, 20, in, in seven years on Cash App, I got $27,900. You saw what I got in 2020, that's four thirty nine sixty seven. This is 2017 to 18, that's $2,385. Um, and in 2019, this was, 2019, it was, uh, $1,540.27. Okay? So, so this is, this is, this is what I, that's all I got. That's all I got. Okay? So, um, Adrian, what I, what I find funny is, and that you're asking me what brought this on, you were in the, you were in the car, you were in a car in New Orleans when the lady's phone got shut off for non-payment. But she's so rich. Natasha, I don't I don't care if anybody doesn't like her, follow her. They can follow her. You can follow her. They do what you want. I'm just saying you, you gotta call a thing a thing. The lady's a liar. The lady's a liar. I, I, the lady's a liar. The, the, the issue is, the issue is, is that the lady is constantly talking about me, but I supposedly don't matter and I'm nobody. I never said she was those things. I never said she was those things. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. So I stayed because I cared, Natasha. I stayed because I was there since day one and I was the one that was going to go to the end because we were going to do exactly what I planned. I changed this perception of her from being just a porn star to an actual person. So I'm trying to understand how you're going to go and call people behind my back that you don't talk to me, trying to say he was nobody. You never see me with him. He, me and him didn't do nothing. Oh, really? So I wasn't there for seven years. I just didn't exist. I just didn't exist. Okay. So thank God Gio didn't, uh, Gio didn't promote his other businesses that he had while he was working with her. Gio didn't promote anything else for Gio um, while he was working with her. While he was working with her, he worked with her solely. And he helped her when he could help her. My, my work is out there. It's proven. Okay? Before there was anybody else in the group, there was me. Just saying. So I don't have to, I don't have to defend that. So I'm just saying all the things that she says that she is. All the things. I backed up everything I'm saying. Hmm. She will never address me. She'll sit over there. She will sit over there. She'll never address me, but she'll sit over there in her shit, talk her shit, 
Get on the camera, talk her shit. Get on, get on, shoot, just blah, 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 run them out, then expect nobody to say nothing back. I let it go, 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 I let it go. Trey Lex, okay, it should have been a contract. This was seven years ago. It's what woulda, shoulda, coulda is not what it is now. It's nothing we can do about that. I'm telling you what it is or what it was. Okay? She was the only one that didn't have a contract. I, I know what needs to happen. She was the only one that didn't have a contract. Okay? So. The point, well, who's, I, I'm trying to see. But, okay, I want you to. I want you to understand. I want you to. What I want. I, I want to understand. I want you to understand. Like, I, cause I see this thing about about contracts with family. I did not. I did not know T. S. Madison before I started working with her. I saw her online. I reached out to her. Two hours later, we were on the phone, and then we started working together. I, she was not my friend. I didn't know her before, so it happened. It happened naturally. We were from the jump. I was there from the jump. I did not feel that we had to have that. I did not feel that we had to have that. There was no reason for us to have that at that time. Okay? So, you got, you got, so you got the amounts of money I made, okay? Which I was supposedly, I was supposedly bawling and running out of control and all these things. You got the amount of money, you got that she doesn't get, she doesn't make any money from her book. Cause she doesn't own it. She doesn't own that music, that first album, so she don't get money from that. Okay? Okay, so let's see what. I, so let's talk about. Let's talk about. You know, because I heard Kaya say on a camera on one of her things one day, because that was sent to me as well. That I heard. I heard Kaya say that Madison pushed Miss Mary out of her chair and broke it. Now, Madison does not physically touch Miss Mary at all, like in that in that in that way in that way. So that was a lie. Okay. I'm not going to lie on the lady just to lie on the lady. So that was a lie. But there was there was three people in the home. Okay? There was Scott, which is kept secret. There was Miss Mary, and there was Madison when her chair broke. When Miss Mary's chair broke. Within 24 hours, if that long, mm -hmm. Kaya knew about that situation. Okay. When I left in February, Within 24 hours, within 24 hours, Armand Wiggins knew why I left on February 6th with full detail. And the only people there at that time were Chi Chi, who was asleep. He was upstairs. He heard the commotion, so he came down because we, we were yelling. So, he, Or I was yelling, I should say. I don't know. We were yelling. So he, he came down, or he stood up at the top and looked down. Scott, once again... And David, the executive producer from WeTV. And Madison. So, my question is, my question is, that within 24 hours twice, with one individual that's there two times, that would lead me to believe that there's a mole in her system that she always blamed to be me, which I had nothing to do with. She fell out with her friend of 17 years for talking about him, telling everybody in the group and be out of the group, okay? Telling everybody in the group and out the group. She wanted him out of her house. His name is Dee Dee. She got mad and blamed me because I'm the natural one to blame because there's some sort of problem that she has with me that she will not address with me. And Dee Dee left while she she and the rest of us were out of the home. And she swears that it's me. That was the camera that broke the shores back because it's like enough of I'm always the problem. You don't you don't like you don't like me for whatever reason. You don't like me. And that's your choice. That is your choice. Okay? That's your choice to, to not like me. But you needed to be an adult and say it to my face instead of talking about me and bashing and doing all this nonsense and talking shit between them. You, 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 were, you were late for talking about me behind the, 
behind the closed doors and talking to everybody as if you didn't think I knew or when I walked into a room, you know, you have you have a problem. You have a problem with me dating white men. This is this is this is dictated. This is noted from video seven years ago. So you don't you don't like white people, even though you sit over there like I like. my. No, you don't. You're a bigot. Madison, you're a bigot. OK, Christopher, I'm sorry. <laughs> you're a bigot. You're a bigot. You're a racist. It is what it is. Don't don't but don't snug up. But the, what I want you to realize is them same black people that you that you like so that you go hard for is none of them black people helped you out. And those white people that you don't like are the only ones trying to help you out. So. Hmm, I wonder. I wonder who's fake, who's phony. You and your mama talk about me and bash me all day night, all day and all night. You think I didn't know, Madison? You think just because I didn't say anything that I didn't know that Miss Mary and you talk about me all day and all night? Miss Mary passing the judgment on to me to tell me that until I until I got until I got OK with my father, I was never going to be happy. How dare you tell me about anybody getting along with my about my my father, and my situation? How dare you judge me? Aren't you supposed to be the church lady? Aren't you supposed to be the church lady? So, 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 so I'm just wondering, are you not the church lady? Have you not, Madison, have you and I not got into it for years because you were being disrespectful to me because I was dating, in your words, white boys? Did Craig, did, was, was Craig, did Craig not ask my mom? How you feel about Jill dating white boys? Yeah, that's what my that's what my life was. We were in a van. Let me tell you about it. we were in a van in Houston, Texas. And the lady told me. The lady, the, the TS told me. The TS told me I was not her friend. OK, remember that Texas trip? It's, it's a video on her YouTube. She's and I was and she said, Jill, I don't think you're my friend. And I was like, oh. And you can honestly get my reaction from the video because I was my face was cracked. OK, but hey. OK, I'm sorry, what? Nicole, you going to wait? Why are you? Um, Nicole, you weren't there. Miss Mary is not who y'all think she do. You, Miss Mary is not who you think she is. You got to remember, Miss Mary is Madison's mother. Madison gets it from somewhere. Don't don't at least you not forget it. Just just be clear. OK, let let's be clear of how nobody talked to me. Okay, so let, let's be clear that if you want to be honest, oh, okay, well, John Michael, you could not think that. There's more, but there's a lot of things, okay? But let's be clear. Miss Mary doesn't call Madison Madison. She calls Madison Boo or Tim. Her brothers call her Tim or brother. The problem is it within Madison. The problem is at home. But Madison puts it out on everybody else. The problem is she don't let's let's be honest. She Madison is seeking Miss Mary's approval. That's why she keeps Miss Mary around, because don't forget, Miss Mary, she moved out. Oh, let's talk about the perfect Miss Mary since we're going to talk about it, since I have a problem. The Kobe. OK. Where I was defending T.S. Madison against Kai and all those people that were attacking her when she didn't do anything wrong. Miss Mary and Madison stopped speaking for damn near a month or two because Miss Mary thought. That that Madison did something to Kaya while Kaya left. Miss Mary blamed T.S. Madison. So what are we going to talk about? She won't answer the phone, Raphael Rice. You missed that? She won't have a conversation. She's too much of a pussy. The real one is not real. She's not real like y'all think. You don't never hear her call her northern. You don't hear Miss Mary call her northern name but Boo or Tim. Every once in a while later, here lately, she's slid into the Madison. OK. So so quit it. That lady's over there talking all that stuff. There's the, I haven't done nothing to that. Like, I, I haven't done nothing to that. Right. And if anyone calls her man, she go correct, Alicia. But her own mama don't. Her own mama 
don't even respect her by her chosen name. So what are you talking about? I'm not, I'm not, that's not, that's not nothing that's not true. You can go through the videos and see it. I'm not telling you nothing that's not true. Oh, yeah. Okay. I've had problems with people since day one walking into the room with this person. I don't, I don't fault Chi Chi for not, you know, saying anything against her because that's like literally like his mama. So I get it. And I, and I, and I'm, I'm glad for them having each other or whatever, but don't, let's not be, let's not forget that Chi Chi has left also because of her not giving a fuck about him. Uh, Natasha Jones, she has addressed me in public. Thank you very much. You think? Yeah, that's why I told you guys to go to watch her subliminal on the on the regular stuff. She has addressed me. She'll just do it subliminally. But if you go to her her Patreon and pay her five dollars, you can see her address me with my name. It's okay. And in the comments, go off. And so, did you miss the video when she posted the video of me at Oliver's birthday and she was in the comments bashing me? Did you miss the video when she said when people stop working at McDonald's, they talk about their old employer? Who who else was that? That was back then. So you missed that? You missed all that. Okay? So that's not, the lady is a farce. The lady is a joke. The lady is so rich, but she makes payment arrangements on her her $200 cell phone every, every month. Now let me say, I make payment arrangements, so I ain't above it. I'm not, it's not about, it's not about, it's not about, I'm not, Reese, I'm not saying nothing about Oliver, so what are you talking about? First of all, motherfucker, I said what the fuck I want to say. Watch your motherfucking mouth. Bitch, you ain't my motherfucking daddy. Bitch, you don't know me. Fuck out of here. Bitch, watch your motherfucking mouth. <laughs> Reese, you don't fucking know me, so watch your motherfucking mouth. I never fucked with you anyway, so, so cut it. <laughs> so cut it. Nigga, watch your motherfucking mouth telling me shit, bitch. This is my motherfucking page. Where I, on my page with my likes, where I pay my bills. Fuck you and what you feel. I ain't say shit about him. And the reason, and the reason I didn't say nothing about him, because at least Oliver was a grown enough man to get on the phone. At least Oliver was a, a, a man enough, was man enough to get on the phone like an adult and have a conversation with me. Oh, okay, Reese, I apologize. I apologize. I didn't mean to go off on you like that because I thought you were telling me to stop by Oliver. I ain't with, I ain't with all that. <laughs> okay. Oliver got on, Oliver got on the phone. Oliver was a, an adult with me about, I want to say a month or two ago and got on the phone with me like an adult and had a real conversation. So I ain't have nothing to say. I don't have nothing to say to Oliver in a derogatory way. I don't have nothing to say about Oliver in the derogatory way. Oliver had a conversation with me. I said what the fuck I had to say. Okay. Okay. But that lady, which, which, which Adrian, since he was so busy to ask me why I was, where did this start from? Adrian was in the car in New Orleans where she came on the, let me see if y'all remember the ones that's been there. When she was in the car, when she ste stepped out on, in, in New Orleans and she was like, let me tell you a story. I called AT&T. <laughs> I called, she had to call AT&T because her phone got disconnected. But I call AT and T, uh, and they had knew me on the phone. She was trying to give you this half a story, like she was the shit because she called in, because she called in because she was the one. So when you called in, she was like, "Yeah, yeah, no, that's not why she called. Her phone got disconnected because she didn't pay her payment arrangement. She makes a payment arrangement every month. She overdraws her bank account every fucking month. Dee Dee can attest to that." Dee Dee can attest to that. The little white slips come in the mail all the time. Okay. Let's, let's clear up what we're going to clear up since you want to. Okay, Megan, you remember that. You're okay. You remember that. Okay. So this lady will tell y'all half a story and make it seem like it is what it is. Okay. Don't, you don't want to, you don't, you, not, not at all. Not at all. Not at all. You don't brag. I don't have a problem with anybody that makes payment arrangements. Like I said, I make payment arrangements. But I sure as hell don't get on the camera and say, Oh, I got money, bitch. Look what I got. Ooh, bitch, I'm the one. I'm the one. Nope, I don't do that. But she does. She does. She does. 
She tells y'all all the time she's a boss. Look, I just bought a BMW as if, as if nobody can buy a BMW in the world because she's the only one. This is how, this is how slow, this is how slow and mental midget she is. She's a mental midget. It's a mental midget. The bitch gives y'all like she's grand, but she ain't shit. The bitch is, the, the, you know what? The problem with Madison is this. Her foundation is from the street. Oh, James Robinson, she did that yesterday with her new furniture. Right, because y'all got to see her new furniture. I like, y'all got to, you got to, because her new furniture. Right, she got to show y'all, see, I didn't even know James Robinson. Thank you for saying. She came on yesterday, I guess, showing her new furniture. Y'all got to see her furniture. Ooh, because ain't nobody ever bought furniture. Really? Really? She talked about she talked about all of us. She talked about Miss Eve like a dog to me. I should have known man what kind of bitch she was. Her supposed best friend that she scream, jump, shout, rhyme, dot, 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 all about. Her, her number one, she ain't never had a friend like Miss Eve. Bitch, you're full of shit. You treat everybody like shit. The only person you care about is yourself. Sylvia Young move, move, move from this. Okay. Anyway. How were you sustaining financially all these years? Natalie, Nicole, I had other businesses. I always had other businesses. I just never talked about it because when I was doing that job, my job was map management to represent my client, T.S. Madison. I don't have to toot my own horn. There's millions of people, millions of billions of people in the world. I sell, I sell my items all the time. I, you guys have seen my post. If you haven't, I have, I have several different businesses. It's, it's, it's not a problem. I pay my taxes. I can't say the same for T.S. I know what I know because I haven't seen taxes be paid since 2014. Oh, so I'm not supposed to say that? Oh. Oh. I wasn't supposed to talk about that. Because you ain't paid tax taxes since 2015, 2014. So you don't remember when she was on the live, when she was on the Maddie in the morning. Again, this is all stuff that's sent to me and, and, and her and Sophia was up there talking and Sophia was like, and she, and she said, oh, yeah, um, when, when Sophia said, well, we, we pay taxes. We pay taxes, right, T.S.? And T.S. was quiet. Y'all didn't wonder? I mean, call the thing a thing. Call it the fuck out. Call it the fuck out. Bitch, you want to sit over there and, and keep running your mouth about me? And because you think you're hiding behind a Patreon where people have to pay, you think you're safe? Bitch, you have them same people that come tell you stuff, come tell me stuff. Bitch, I, you know what I did? Let me tell you what I did. So I knew that it was true. I gave you $5. I know you needed the $5 because you got bills over there. Like you like to say, you got real bills. You got real bills. So I gave you $5. I gave you 5 And I hope that that helps. I hope that that helps you. But I wanted to tell you that you should go over there. Y'all should go to her Patreon and pay her $5 because she need it. So she could tell y'all more stories about how sickening she is and how much she got money. So y'all, y'all never worried. Y'all never wondered how the person been saying, I've been a millionaire for years, which she has. I'm not even, she has made millions of dollars through her time. So I will say this, you know, I'm not going to lie on her just a lot, you know, just because, you know, I'm a millionaire and all these things. And yes, she has said she's frugal and she saves her money and I get all that. But you cannot say and shout and brag and boast and all you got all this. But your basement is like that. Your clock, your, 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 your house is atrocious. Your house is from 10 years old. It's so dilapidated and old. And my first time I walked in there, I was like, where's my room? I'm not so impressed. I know that you're impressed by this because her foundation is the street. Her own mama and her didn't get along. So she had to go out in the street and get... And, and get, yes, Selena, completely correct, Selena Cooper. But Madison's foundation is the street. So she had to go out into the street to get, to get motherhood, to get fathership, to get these things. My dad was a piece of shit, but at least I had my dad to leave his eight, till I was 18 years old. My mom and my dad. Okay? Yes, Kina, okay. So Kina, you want to talk about Funky Doniva? Well, let's talk about when we went to the Dominican Republic. Funky Doniva laid motherfucking T.S. Madison the fuck out. She ain't never told you that. Laid her to fucking doomsday. Laid her to doomsday. Told her she wasn't shit. 
Madison has a problem with everybody that's educated. When you go to college, the first thing she says to you, I know I'm not educated. And she said, if y'all really go back to videos and listen, I know I'm not educated. I didn't go to college to get nothing. She feels some type of way because her upbringing is supposed to be our problem because of her upbringing. We didn't do it. But, but Funky Daniva cussed her out. And if you think about it, after the Dominican Republic trip, when was the next time you saw Funky Daniva? Tell me if I'm lying. Think about it. Because you didn't see Daniva for a minute. I wait. But he's back now. Y'all done seen him since then. But I'm just saying, if you got all these money and you got all this money, you should have, where's your basement? You, 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 yeah, now, according to, you know, I'm finding out you're showing off your furniture. So you find, you, the beds in the other, in the spare rooms are from 10 years ago from your old house in Marietta. Say Washington, thank you. Yes, because they stopped. You didn't see Donnie for a minute, then they came back, and then he came back. Yes. Yes. Just like, just like, you know, she was cool. She made up with what his, his, um, his boy name used to be, Dre Antonio. But now he's Sade. She is Sade now. And Sade, she had, Madison went and had Cherry, De, Cherry Boom on the show just to get back at Samantha. That's how petty and low down she is. Just to, to show Samantha James that she couldn't be on the show. So I'm going to have this other girl on here to make you upset. Because this is where this lady's mindset at. She's a mental midget. It's a mental midget. I'm, sure, I'm, I'm giving you time now so you can see it yourself. Come to find out, Sade had asked her not to have this person on the, on the, on the show. Because this person, when it was a boy, when, when Sherry was a boy, raped him, her. Well, when Sherry was a boy... Sherry as a boy raped Dre, Sade as a boy, Dre. And he, she begged and pleaded with Madison not to have Sherry on the show. But Madison was about Madison and still had that person on the show. But she's supposedly cool and a friend with, with Sade. If that's your kind of friend, if that's, your, if that's what you call friendship, Madison, I don't need you. So y'all tell me, what about Cookie? Cookie's trash. Krishna, what about Cookie? So, so y'all tell me, y'all tell me what, where, where you don't see that this person lays this out. You tell me where these lies are at. You tell me how this is not, this is some fake phony thing. What, what, where's, where I, I have, I have taken all I'm going to take. This lady is disrespectful. Now I could call in. I have two, I could call in people. I, we could get, I mean, I'm not, after this, I haven't said it all now. There's nothing I, oh, I'm sorry. I done told you about that. I done told you. Okay, well, let's talk about somebody. I did forget. Let's talk about somebody on your own team, not me, but your own team is telling people outside of the team because I've heard it several times since I've left. So you, so you, your person on your team is telling people or a person you talk to, because maybe it's not a person on your team. Maybe it's just people you talk to or, or, or peers, people that that person talks to. I don't know. But that person is telling other people that they have seen, people have seen HIV medication in your bag. That's not me. I didn't do that. I have nothing to do with that. But these are these so-called people. You're so worried about me. You're so worried about me. Accusing me because I'm the easy scapegoat. I'm the one that you want to go off on. Denise, Denise, you think I give a fuck if she says some Dade County? The fuck? See, Denise, this is my thing. Yeah, this this is my thing, Denise, Denise. Y'all so worried about she gonna send her date. Why does she? Why does the big bad wolf? Why does the big bad wolf with the big ass mouth have to send anybody else when they so motherfucking bad? Christopher, I'm sorry, it's too far for you. Oh well. But why does the why does the big bad wolf have to say somebody? So. So let's talk about it. Kaya has attacked her and attacked her and attacked her. Kaya is 20 minutes from her door. Kaya is 20 minutes from her door. I'm not reading her health, Christopher. I did not read her health. I'm saying this is what is coming out. This is what people are saying. I didn't say that. I didn't say, I, just, I didn't say she had that. I don't know that. From what I know, that's not to be true. That is not true. But from what I, but I'm telling you, this is what's going around about her shit. 
So anyway, anyway, you want to talk. So this, so Kaya is 20, 20 minutes from her door. Kaya is 20 minutes from her door. And she ain't done shit to this person, but she stay telling somebody to go fuck her up. Or she tell, she get on the Patreon. Mom, go, let me tell you what she, let, this is, this is, this is proper behavior. Let, this is proper behavior. Hold on. Moderates, you are, are to be in full of force tonight. We do not tolerate the enemy or their minions in the empire. Destroy. So this is what you're supposed to do? This is what you're supposed to do? This is what you're supposed to do. This is what, so, so you don't, so you're going to deny that you put this up? You, are you going to deny that you put this up? Rontarius Wallace, did you miss, did you miss the fact that she won't answer the phone? Mm -hmm. She hasn't, she won't, she won't have a real conversation. Did you miss that? She has my number. She has my numbers. I have her numbers. What clout do I need? What do I get from this? Do I get paid? Tell me, Rontarius, since you know. Tell me. Tell me. Can you let us hear the Patreon? What are you talking about? Let you hear it. What are you talking about? What about Norfolk, Virginia? What that got to do with any? What that got to do with anything? I don't know, Natasha. I can't say that, but there's people that are doing that. Well, K. Shanta, then I'm then then then, then I'm better than this. Okay, cool. I don't know. So 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 Kaya lived 20 minutes down the street. She ain't never done nothing to Kaya. Michelle Brown has been bashing her and coming at her with completely, completely disgusting, untrue, undis disgusting things. She don't do nothing about that. But then when she can pick, when she can find somebody that she can pick on, she'll attack them like Nick at night because she attacked that girl for no reason. Y'all have to address. You don't have to. The lady has been attacking people all week. Y'all done told me. Y'all week she done done this. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. I said from what I know, Christopher, it's not true. Meaning that I'm not going to lie on a person that I don't know. But this is what is being said and what is going around. Tarika, I'm not insinuating that. I could bring on the person. I'm not insinuating that. I'm just saying what they say. A person that is in the camp supposedly told another person in the camp. And it's getting out. So if I, I, I who, what? Whatever. I, I just don't understand how nobody sees what's right there and, and, and right there in black and white. I just showed you exactly what. So if I was so, if I was so here for money and I was so here for my own personal gain, I just wonder why I only made $27,000, $27,900 from Cash App in seven years. I only made these little amounts in these years. And this is only three different years. Like, seriously? What are you talking about? So it is what it is. But I'm just saying the lady don't, the, 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 the lady with the big mouth always talking about she don't give a fuck. She got guns. She got this. She got that. I'm going to say I got a daughter. I got a niece. I got whatever. She don't never address nothing or handle nothing herself. So if it's not important, if it's not something you want to handle or talk about, then don't. Then don't. Y'all get so mad when somebody addresses somebody constantly, constantly talking about them. And then it's, it's the person's fault for addressing them back with factual information. I'm not bringing up nothing. There's nothing for me to go. I'm not bringing up nothing that's not real. So, I, so again, I have to come out here and prove it. And I'm still wrong when I prove what I'm talking about. I just don't understand. Like, I don't understand. Yeah, but she was, but, but mm, Kai was saying stuff in a different way. And she wasn't articulate. PJ, what am I supposed to think about Craig? Craig is Craig. I don't know Natasha. I showed it. I showed it. So tell me. There it is. Kaya couldn't have warned me. I was there before Kaya, bro. <laughs> Kaya was there before me. 
I'm um, excuse me. I was there before Kaya. So what are you talking about, Bo? Kaya didn't have to warn me. Kaya did her own shit too, though. So don't get don't get it twisted. Don't get it twisted. Don't 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 act like she was. Oh, oh no, because she was not. No, I did not say that, Natasha. I did not. I said, from what I know, that is not true that she has that. But that people are saying that it's on her team. No, PJ, I don't want to come on your show. I don't need to come on nobody's show. <laughs> I don't need to come on nobody's show. I didn't come for no queen. So, so since it's not since that's, since we talking about, since the lady want to go, now don't forget, I want y'all to go back. Let me go back. I want y'all to go back so you can get it because she needs y'all, she needs y'all five dollars. Go to her Patreon. Go to her Patreon and give her five dollars because she needs it so she can talk about me over there because she won't address it. She won't address me. She won't address me. What What do you want us to do? Joan and Randall, y'all do whatever y'all want to do. The point she's going to see, the, the point is to her. The point is to her. Ma'am, since you can't be a real woman, since you're so bad and you're so real and you want to pretend to everybody, you don't say anything? And, this, and you don't say anything? Yeah. Since I'm so, since I didn't exist, since I'm so nobody, since you didn't care about me, since I never mattered, since these are the things that you're saying, T.S. T.S. Madison, these are the things that you're saying. So since this is what you want to say, yeah, since I'm not any of these things, here you go, because I guess I was here just because. She, she did make money. What are you talking about? She made money. No. So, this is what you wanted to do? This is what? Correct. Thank you. Thank you, Bianca Martin, for understanding, because that's exactly it. He is not saying that she is positive. All she's saying is that these things are the things that her people are saying about her. Correct, Bianca Martin. Correct, not me. The point is, the point is, oh, my status is HIV negative. What's your point? On pre on, on prep, what's what's your point? I don't understand. We I, I don't I, I don't I mean I could get mine from mine is in my phone. I don't understand. I don't yes, David, I remember you asking me if I'm if I'm okay. It's not overwhelming me. It's just that I'm tired of the lady is will get on a public platform and she will get on the public platform and say she ain't saying nothing. You see him over there doing this or that, but she's lying when she's in her Patreon where she charges you five dollars. She got to charge you five dollars to go listen to her talk about me and do her shit. And say, if you a real one, just say what you got to say. Pick a phone up, answer a text message, send a text message. You know both the numbers. Call, call the number. You know both the numbers. You're blocked on one, but you're not blocked on the other one. So call the numbers. Be a real one. I tried. I attempted. I texted you. I called you. You didn't answer either one. Okay. So you're not about it. What are you talking about? Under, you see, what are you? What is? What is? What is going on? Katie Booth, the garden is good. PJ Hargrove, none of them people talk to me now. None of the group of the of the people talk to me. None of the people in the group talk to me. It's okay. I'm okay with that. I don't. I don't. The garden is good. The garden is, is wet right now because <laughs> it's, it's raining out. The garden is good. So it is what it is. So it's fine. You know, I just I just wanted to come on here and finally address all of that because I'm tired of it. I'm tired of the sneak dissing. I'm tired of the I'm tired of the shit talking. I'm tired of you. I'm tired of Madison hiding behind a fucking five dollar Patreon group so she can bash me. And then you got bitches that's on my page, Kayla Patrice Davis, thinking that she's running over there telling her something. And bitch, you think I didn't know that that's why you was on my page to begin with? 
And then you trying to say the fans is on my page listening to me and then going and then talking. Like you telling somebody like nobody could do what they want to do. I don't what the what the fan I got time for this. Katie, I, um, yeah, well, I'm going to do the fall garden, like the fall plants now. Like, I'm going to do the fall plants. So. Anyway. Anyway. So, that's it. I spoke my piece. I put, I, it's right there. So, that's, that's, that's my piece. I said what I said. I proved my point. It is what it is. So, it is what it is. Have a good day. Bye-bye.